this, this show's going smooth as hell. Do you guys want to talk about Nanette? No, we already I mean, we already talked about Nanette. Did we? No, we haven't. I, I like to call her Vanette because with that ass, she looks like a fucking conversion. Right? <laughs> got her <laughs> oh, bitch, fat. What, what do you got? A goddamn RV <laughs> in those <laughs> pants? <laughs> Yeah, here's some other names I've been workshopping for. With Waldo? How about that? Who's Waldo? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go off. Yeah. Um, You got more? Yeah. Um, I don't know. I mean, there's a lot of problems with that. Did you watch it? I just read. I just watched watched the trailer. I watched, you watched the special. I watched, yeah, I watched the whole Wait, thing. Wait, are wow. you for real? You yeah. Watched it? Well, I, I mean, everybody's I feel like you have to watch. Why the fuck it? would yeah. I watch it? I just watched the trailer with also, Stop, and we were both first like, of all, <laughs> yeah, but it's not right. It's not a comedy special. My she, nuts it's itch. a one woman show, right? Uh, I mean, I guess. Were there punchlines? Uh, there were. I mean, it's it's like you know, it just seems like shitty Australian comedy. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. then there's a whole section there about how she was raped. Yikes! Oh, that's what it's about. Yeah, she's like, the, men rape me. I was right. Oh, jeez, Louise. Yeah, yeah, I don't trust me <laughs> because I write me. It's she like, said it like that? Don't do it in a funny voice. Did she yeah, say Yeah, right. exactly. <laughs> if you want us to take you seriously. Um, Damn, that's fucked up. Yeah. Did she say the N-word or... She did. Implied it. Yeah, I mean, we all know what she means by men. <laughs> <laughs> a, a whole pack of them. Is what the term <laughs> they were wilding <laughs> out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> a whole pack of men <laughs> wilding, mm-hmm. bunch of they were they all came kind over of, they wilding. Well, she is from Tasmania, is really? She? Yeah, that's where Damn. they make them. <laughs> that's where they come from. <laughs> mm-hmm. Damn, dude, yeah. we're gonna be banned from the country before we can probably. Get I'm sure. Isn't all I should like except for Jim? It Jeffries, is funny. Everyone it is funny, is bad it at is comedy, funny right? to imagine Terrible. to imagine Nanette like. <laughs> Just, you know, she's just going about her day or whatever in Tasmania. And then there's like a, l- a little tornado that comes up <laughs> oh, no. and she just gets sucked into the tornado. <laughs> and then the tornado <laughs> leaves and her hair is all fucked up and she's covered in cum. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah. oh my God. <laughs> well, that's not what happened in Tasmania. I wow. Mean, <laughs> look, I'm just pitching yeah. jokes for her to use. That yeah, would have been, been a good one. Yeah. would have been a good one. Well, you know, I'm from Tasmania, uh, so you know how it happens there. <laughs> Well, I'm uh, mad you guys didn't go with me on the little tornado bit. Yeah, I'm no, I thought it was <laughs> people are going to get upset about that. <laughs> I thought it was. A and great... I wanted all of us to participate in it instead of just me. No, well, I'm I. Adam's jealous I of was the way wearing, she does comedy. I was wearing yeah. flip flops. Um, Adam, maybe you should get a, a big wide ass like that, mm-hmm. and that would help your comedy. My career, yeah. Well, people do like. Their comics with and, uh, bad For the bodies. record, I'm not body shaming her. Those pants were a mistake to wear. Mm. Especially what kind of sh- pants was she wearing? She, well, her pants were too tight. But They're being like sucked ass. into her ass. Mm. Yeah. And then they keep shooting her from behind. Yeah. And it looks like her pants are... Just a real... Wait, so the whole... Close up on her ass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> most of it, yeah. Most of the Wait, specials. so it was a shot... It was shot ass first. It was. Mm-hmm. That, mm-hmm. I See, I think that's a mistake for a comedy, fe- a comedy <laughs> special. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to want to see the face. Yeah, um, I would. I'd do that. Do a comedy special, and then it keeps showing from behind, and my pants and shirt are tu- are shoved into my ass. <laughs> 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 just, just sucked away in into my head. Yeah. And what? You got to press two for English? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't care to investigate it, but it seemed like. Jake was getting into fights with people about Nanette on Twitter or something. Yeah, I'm sure everybody wants to fight about it. Because it's either you're in two camps. You're either on a New York comic and you have to say it's bad, or mm-hmm. you're a Los Angeles comic and you have to pretend like you <laughs> fucking had like some sort of emotional breakthrough <laughs> watching it. Yeah. And they're like, wow, this changed how I thought about comedy forever. I used to think it was about using mannerism tricks and singing your punchlines. <laughs> right. Um, Talking um, about go okay. yeah. <laughs> I thought it, I thought it was saying so. That's a thing. So instead of actually having any sort of joke, really, <laughs> but mm-hmm. instead it's just recounting your trauma to a theater full of people. <laughs> yeah, but you know, like I didn't see it obviously, but it seemed like it was like done like she's doing a special, and then she's like, you know what? Never mind. But like, if it was spontaneous in a single performance. Then that would be like okay, she's like breaking the whole 
the yeah, whole format. Gonna, how the fuck are you going to do that? But if you're doing that night in and night out, like, you know what? Never mind. Then it's just contrived and stupid. Yeah, of course right? it is. Well, it's a performance. I mean, every... I mean, yeah. Uh, we're every, not... Yeah, that's not a knock on... The, but if of, of all the ways to criticize <laughs> Nanette, pick the dumbest one. <laughs> yeah. Why? You're, you well, basically not, did She may seem like it was spontaneous, but yeah. it turns out she wrote her material. You basically no, did I'm the not thing people that don't understand comedy say about comedy. No, I'm not saying that. Yeah, yeah. Did we just come up with all that stuff? On the fly? <laughs> no, I was. I came to that. the early show, and that was all the same <laughs> shit. <laughs> That's not what I was saying. That's literally what you're saying. No, what I'm saying is, is that it's presented as she's going to be doing an hour of comedy, and then she like pulls the rug by stopping doing the comedy, like spont. Like, and it's supposed Does to she... feel like spontaneous. Hmm. No, I don't know. What the fuck are you That's doing? What you I haven't assume. even seen it. I haven't seen it. So what are we even talking about? I don't know. <laughs> I did see the trailer, and she said that people. People th- think she looks like a like a bloke, mm. which was pretty funny. Pretty good. Yeah, it's a pretty funny joke. You know what I look like? And then she did that for... She did like a Cameron Esposito. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. People think I'm a, a black. Yeah, that's the thing. Is like I really don't understand how what she does is any different than what Cameron Esposito does. In fact, let me s- actually... Let me see if Cameron said that she likes Nanette. Because Ooh. I feel like she would hate it. That's true. Do you think Cameron she's, Esposito is like... She's oh, got to be, she's my, gotta be pissed. On yeah. my turf. On my... On my turf of shitty comedy. <laughs> yeah. Um, I, I would be... And I mean, I, you know, I don't know Cameron Esposito. I don't know her fucking emotional state, but I would imagine... Because all of these people are self-serving fucking narcissists anyways. Yeah, I don't see any tweets here about that. Now, mm. Granted, this is only going back to June 29th. That's so funny. It's, you know, it's like... You know she's mad. Uh, yeah. For she's, sure. She's got to be mad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Because this, <laughs> honestly, doing something like this is kind of like what her whole career has been building up to. I know. And you know what? It, it's like... <laughs> that actually rules. Hats off. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> if you look at it, Shout that out to lens the net. Yeah. by cucking yeah. <laughs> the American fucking version of her, salute. Oh, uh, I'm a lesbian. Yeah. I feel like Cameron's probably sitting around just pissed off going, she's not even Hispanic. <laughs> <laughs> Well, isn't that what she tried to do with rape jokes? Doesn't she have a special called yeah, rape jokes? Yeah, she has a special about rape jokes that people aren't talking about because people are talking about Nanette. Yeah, damn. Damn. You think yeah. Cameron Esposito is trying Nanette. to fucking run the hit on Nanette? Dude. Why that. is it called Nanette? Her name's Hannah. Yeah, they explain it in the special. Nah, that's a problem right there, bro. <laughs> right there, I don't like that. Your name's I'm not Hannah. Gonna watch Name it. your special Hannah. Hannah. Yeah. Nanette, the fuck does that mean? That means I'm calling you Nanette. Little. I don't know. I, to be honest with you, I kind of zoned out here and there while watching it because I was looking up the different types of wheat thins on Wikipedia. Yeah. Look, dude, I straight up, I'm back at June 14th now, and not a single fucking tweet Ooh, about Nanette. Ooh, damn. Yeah. What about yeah. her wife? Um, there are people, I just searched both of their names. There are people that are saying, if you like Nanette, you should check out Cameron Esposito's Those jokes. are bots. Yeah. Those are no, those alts. are just lesbian women. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's probably true. Oh, that is so funny, dude. That is hilarious. That is. I, I wish I wish this wasn't such a low energy podcast that I could get excited about. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm actually legitimately very stoked on I this. I know. That's so yeah, funny. It it's rocks. Great. That's, that's Cameron a, Esposito hates Nanette. And that is actually that a big scoop there. of our part. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We just yeah, cracked yeah. the code. You're I'm tempted to, to just go, just say that Nan, just really just go hard defending Nanette now because of out of spite. <laughs> <laughs> we got to do it. We're pro yeah. Nanette. You should. I mean, honestly, if you have to compare the two, uh, Anna Gatsby's a million times better. I'm sure. Yeah. yeah. And there really is only room for one. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Mm-hmm. How are you going to call another man by your own damn name? <laughs> just like <laughs> a black comedian not understanding the movie Call Me By Your Name. I don't understand it. Why did they call each other by It doesn't each really names? make sense. Yeah, it's like one of those weird things that people do in relationships. Oh, so he would just call, like, if I, if I was fucking Adam, I'd be like, hey, stop. stop, 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 my stop. Dick. No, they were yeah. like, stop, 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 Adam, 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 Adam. I think that's what they did in the movie. Mm. It didn't really make sense. Did they call each other their names while they fucked? Yeah. Nice. Um, yeah, they call each other Nanette. <laughs> <laughs> that does sound like an Australian slur for a gay man, a Nanette. Yeah. Dude, let's shout out to Nanette. Now that we're officially pro Nanette, 
Dude, come I'm, through the show. Hey, yeah, come through. Enemy of an enemy is my friend. That's yeah, right. enemy of an enemy. <laughs> it's Game of Thrones out here, yeah, dude. She's like, I'm not enemies. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we know you hate Cameron Esposito. And she hates I also, you. I mean, I, don't I know, know we know you just did this her. to dog that ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're just trying to dog. <laughs> you're trying to dog. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. What are you talking about? Uh, the true detective. True, true detective. It was. He was just saying gobbledygook. Nah, he was. He was How about true nanek net nanective? Yeah. That's what we've been it's missing. Like, uh, my ass is a flat circle. <laughs> <laughs> my ass is a big flat circle, <laughs> and we like it. That's the point. A lot of people we... are like, oh, look at that wide bloke. He looks like the angry block from Super Mario sixty four. <laughs> Good, good bloke. Yeah. Good bloke, that angry good bloke. bloke. Hey, where, where's that bloke's band aid? And then they get up close and realize I'm not that angry cement block from Super Mario. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually a Lezo. <laughs> from far away, people think I'm a Roo. Yeah. <laughs> and they get close and realize I'm just a Lezo. I'm a Lezo. They think good bloke. Nope. Just I a have Lezo. built a career of calling myself. That cement block from <laughs> Super Mario 64, <laughs> and I simply will not do it anymore. Maybe I should fix myself by not rejecting irony, but going just nothing but earnestness Whoa, at no. all times. Be post-irony. That yeah, go Nanette, baby. Nanette's not... Well, I guess Nanette She's is, sincere. but most of the people most of the people in that... Re- that realization a couple weeks ago that Cameron Esposito probably hates it, Yeah, and then realizing that that's true, I've since found out that that is true. Nice. How does that make um, you feel? Well, I guess it like answers like a lot of the things that like kind of made me upset with woke art and like woke bullshit over the last couple of years. Blog feminism got popular in like 2013. Like, and you know, I've always just been a comedian. I didn't go to school. Yeah. yeah. My entire adult life, I've been a comedian. My mm-hmm. entire world has been comedy, and yep. comedy is a very stupid world you filled with dumb very people. Young. Yeah. And uh, so there was none of that. There was none of like conversations about like identity politics or whatever. It was all. It was just comedy. Yeah, seeing if you could do well. In and a then world. that Hitchens essay came out, Isn't and then that's funny? when like wokeness sort of stuck its head into the world of comedy. Yeah. And then it ramped up. Well, anyways, what I was saying about all this like woke shit shows up, and it's like you're not like you don't disagree with like the actual things they're saying. But you don't know why it like bothers you, and it's like because it's like most of the time just inherently cynical. It's cynical. It's just a way to get a career in entertainment. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it's hard to accuse somebody of that. You just, as a comedian, you can smell the bullshit or whatever. Yeah. And uh, and then that's like not bullshit. I think it's not funny, and like yeah. none of, I think a lot of the points she makes are like pretty stupid. But it feels <laughs> honest. You know result. when this all started, honestly, when you watch Call Me by Your Name, dude. Uh huh. Gay de- propaganda de- descend- infect your No, Call brain. Me By Your Name and Nanette were both two things I saw in the last year that, like, because it's very hard, again, to make, like, <laughs> something that's, like, totally. sentimental that isn't fucking, j- it doesn't cross the line into being, like, Bad. schmaltzy, corny. saccharine, corny, which yeah. Nanette doesn't really do, but there's, like, they're different, for different reasons, good. But it, anytime that I'm, like, surprised by something that I think I'm going to fucking hate, and it's like, mm-hmm. oh, yeah, that was actually pretty good, I mean, it means something to me. Yeah, um, and both of those, like, I, yeah. Now that because you're like, there's humanity under my. Because I, 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 I sat down and I actually watched Nanette all the way through, and it's not powerful or anything, but like, yeah, I mean, so it's much coherent. Com- it's coherent, and like, yeah. she's speaking honestly, and very few comedians do That's that. True. Yeah, it's like you know, I they are looking for the right thing to say in a particular moment. Right, and is I mean, it necessarily comedy then? <clears throat> it's just like a one woman show. No, it's bad comedy, it's but bad comedy. it's but good it's art, I guess. I mean, yeah. not and not even that. I, I don't have it's much. Just honest it's, art. What it is? It's yeah. different than every special I've seen. Yeah, yeah And yeah. it's in a way where, like, the core of what's that man at? I don't mm-hmm. really have a problem with. Because, and that's the thing too. Is like, I don't like that it's labeled as comedy. But like, when you speak honestly on those things, if that had been done like the whole time, and like kind of why I was like with like the Me Too stuff, it's like, oh yeah, obviously. But like a lot of woke posturing again, it's like yeah, cynical. It's cynical. Mm-hmm. It's just I don't trust it. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. Sure. These nuts. <laughs> Got it. <he. laughs> Got it. <he. laughs>